Hi, it's Amanda with Music Game Club, and today I am going to walk you through our Magpie Melodies cards. So here is deck one, and with this one, it is teaching your students the tonic, median, and dominant. It starts with a guide card, in case you don't know those, and you're just going to drag the magpie to the melody that starts on either the tonic, or the median, or the dominant. And you're going to click Submit, and it features C, E, and G. So in the key of C major. Deck two is one of my absolute favorites. So this is a really good ear training sight reading game. There is a direction card to start off with to kind of explain how it's done. But what you do is you're going to click play and it's going to play the melody. If you notice, one measure is missing. So the student has to listen, figure out which melody is missing and drag it to the missing measure. The different pieces take turns for which measure is missing. Sometimes it's the first, or the last, or the second. Every single measure is missing in some card in the deck. Magpie Melodies Deck 3 is an ear training game. If you see, there's the direction card that tells your students how to do it. You're going to tap the audio button, listen to the melody. It is playing one of these excerpts, and then you have to tap which one you think it is. This is really important because if you notice, there's always the same rhythm. So they have to listen very carefully for the melodies that are being played. And finally, deck four is missing the last note. This is really good for your students' ear training because they're gonna click the audio button, they're gonna hear a melody, and they're gonna have to figure out what that last pitch is. And this is where I would teach my students to listen, does it go higher, does it go lower, or does it stay the same? It is very easy in that there's no rhythm tricks. It is either giving you a quarter note answer or a half note answer, and you just have to figure out what the pitch is. So this is a really good ear training game. If your students are not ready for deck two from earlier, this is where they will need to start. I hope you and your students have fun with our Magpie Melodies Boom Cards. You can also get our printable game, which is also super fun.